My training routine is a well-rounded combination of cardiovascular exercise, strength training, and core workouts, providing a holistic approach to fitness. Let's break down the different components of my training. Morning routine. 1. 5 km morning run. Cardiovascular benefits. Running 5 kilometers each morning offers excellent cardiovascular benefits. It enhances heart health, boosts endurance, and burns calories, contributing to weight management and overall fitness. Mental well-being. Running can have positive effects on mental health, reducing stress and promoting a sense of well-being. Consistency. The daily nature of your run promotes consistency, which is crucial for long-term fitness. 2. Strength training. Squats, 70 reps. Squats are an excellent lower body exercise targeting the quadriceps, hamstrings, glutes, and lower back. Doing 70 reps adds muscular endurance benefits and over time it can contribute to increased lower body strength. Push-ups, 20 reps. Push-ups engage the chest, shoulders, and triceps. While 20 reps may be more focused on muscular endurance, it still provides strength benefits, especially for the upper body. Sit-ups, 20 reps. Sit-ups work the abdominal muscles, enhancing core strength and stability. Evening routine, fun wall pushes, 70 reps. Upper body endurance. Wall pushes provide a different angle of resistance compared to traditional push-ups, emphasizing endurance in the chest, shoulders, and triceps. Accessible. Wall pushes are accessible for various fitness levels and can be done at home without equipment. Two squats, 70 reps. Additional leg work. Incorporating another set of squats in the evening reinforces lower body strength and endurance. It's a great way to ensure consistent training for the legs. Considerations and suggestions. Wamang. Variation. Introducing variety into your routine can prevent plateaus and keep things interesting. Consider adding different types of runs, sprints, intervals, or incorporating variations of squats and push-ups. 2. Rest and recovery. Ensure that you allow your body adequate time to rest and recover. Overtraining can lead to fatigue and increased risk of injury. Consider incorporating rest days or lighter exercise days into your routine. 3. Nutrition. Fueling your body with a balanced diet is crucial for performance and recovery. Make sure to stay hydrated and consume a mix of carbohydrates, proteins, and healthy fats. 4. Progress tracking. Consider keeping a log of your workouts to track your progress. This can help you identify improvements, set goals, and make adjustments to your routine as needed. Flexibility and mobility. Including stretches and mobility exercises can enhance flexibility and reduce the risk of injury. Consider incorporating a brief stretching routine after your workouts. 6. Consultation. If you have any underlying health conditions or concerns, it's advisable to consult with a fitness professional or healthcare provider to ensure your training routine aligns with your overall health goals. Overall, my training routine covers a broad spectrum of fitness components, promoting cardiovascular health, muscular strength, and core stability. Consistency and a well-rounded approach are key elements for achieving and maintaining overall fitness with no equipment.